My name is Sammy McCarthy. I started boxing, I think, mainly because my, my elder brother had boxed before me, was quite successful as an amateur. And I started boxing in 1946 in Stepney. And because um, I, I wanted to sort of emulate my, my, my older brother, and I, I, I loved every moment of it anyway. And I think the reason, one of the reasons I boxed is because I was so, I was so nervous and so frightened that I was frightened of being frightened. And so, to prove my masculinity to myself, even as a little boy, I had to overcome that, which I did. And I loved every moment of it, every every moment, both as an amateur and professional. I had about 110 amateur contests, and um, I, once again, I, I lost my first one. I lost my last one, fun enough, but um, I won the majority of them. About, I, I, think, I, I think I lost about eight contests during, during my amateur career, and I loved every moment of it. I never turned professional in 1951. Again, I enjoyed every, every conceivable moment of boxing as a professional. I loved the training, etc., and so forth. It was great. You know? and I think I, I think I had about 50, 60 contests. I lost eight. But the eight guys I lost to were all, it was all champions, all great fighters. And um, sometimes in life, it's not how many fights you have, it's who you fight. <laughs> I, mean, I, I, I got beat by some good men, and I beat some good men. But again, I, you know, it's sort of, um, it was a wonderful experience, and um, wonderful, wonderful experience. So I, I, I can't emphasize that enough. Uh, So many, I'm still friends with them today, and I love them, love them all as I do today. And funny enough, where I was born in Stepney, there's a hell of a lot of, lot of great Jewish boxers about them. The things time to heart for them, and there's no doubt for some of the Indian guys and all the foreigners over here now. Are you with me? And um, the first name I remember, I think, was Harry Mazer, and then, and then. Um, Jack Kid Berg and Harry Misler and Ted Kid Lewis, all great Jewish fighters, and so many other Jewish fighters. And I used to follow them somehow, the other for whatever reason. Mm. I follow them all, and I know all their history, and I know all their history. I've met them all, and I love talking to them, I love speaking about them. And um, when I speak about them, it's not always speaking about the past, it's about happy memories. So you know, Great fighters. As all, when, when was it great? I mean, absolutely great fighters. In those days, it's, God knows how many more fighters then than, than, than there are, are today. And times are hard enough nowadays. But in, in them days, we've got it comparatively easy. It's much as harder in those days. So I can imagine what they must have gone through. Right? Yes.